Okay. What's up, you guys? Let's get a quick message today. So we're starting out with ORM. ORM in Urban Dictionary is at a loss for words and then quest. So I don't know if somebody, if you're at a loss for words, but somebody, it, it's, um, you know, the quest, like a mission, a task. Somebody is at a loss for words. So let's see what this is about. Hit the like button for me, you guys. Measure to this measure. M maybe this is like someone's at a loss for words at how big this mission is. I don't know if this is you or someone else. Tell me about this, please. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. What's this to a sword? Tell me about this. Oh. Aw. At a loss for words? At, is this you, Divine Feminine? Libra or Taurus? Are you at a loss for words? At how many people are just mean? It feels like how many people are just mean or how many people... You know, this could even be at a loss for words for uh, the amount of hurt that's that's on this planet. Just betrayal, trauma... How many people possibly just cut this out or they ignore it, you know? Let me see, though, because I feel like this is going to mean something different for every one of you. So let me just see. <sighs> At a lost for words. Tell me more. Electronic harassment. Okay. I knew see, it was. I just want to get right down to it. So there's I don't know if it's you. Or some other people are at a loss for words with how many people wanted to attack you, Divine Feminine, with electronic harassment. There are people that are at a loss for words at how many devices there are, I feel like. How many people use this stuff. <clears throat> Tell me about the electronic harassment. How many people have possibly like maybe this is going to be like people are going to be at a loss for words when they find out how many people have actually passed away from the electronic harassment they didn't know it was going to be to this measure right this length that's what I feel like yeah queen of swords Gemini Libra Aquarius but I feel like you could have talked about this but, so this could be you talking about this Maybe in the past you were talking about this and people didn't believe you that this even happened. You could have told people that you're going to get karma in the past for, for using these devices. They, they, there could even be people who were at a loss for words at the repercussions for using these things. Okay, I don't feel like a lot of these people understood that I'm pretty sure this is like murder or attempted murder charge. Tell me the truth. Is this like... um? attempted murder is this like murder i don't feel like these people knew did they know that they were going to catch a charge for this yeah so there there could be just at a loss for words on both sides right like maybe you or some other people at a loss for words like i can't even believe how many people have access to these things i can't believe that people actually have lowered themselves to be such cowards and bullies to to even do this stuff covertly and then i also think that the people who use them read a loss for words at the time that they're getting or the charge detective is on your side i'm telling you there's agents and detectives that are like we're even in shock at how many people use these or how many people want to attack this woman interrogated i'm telling you i think that once the, now they could be interrogating some of the some of these people who have used them that may want to work with these people with these detectives hey, look how could you Mm -mm -mm. interrogated and how could you oh there could even be people setting up their own people okay this is what i'm getting the charge for these things is big and i think that until they realize that how solid this is it just kind of was a thing right but there's detectives and possibly agents that know holy shit this is actually a thing now and it's bigger than we thought so 
this could have just been a law recently passed or this is just what it was hold on did they did they just recently pass a law or something about this electronic harassment and i feel like these people had no idea it's going to be a murder rap or attempted murder right how many people have died because of these things? But I think that there's people setting their own people up. Like, how could you have me bring this thing? There could be people that are, because this, look at how this woman is pregnant. This this divine feminine, this card is pregnant. There could even be people who didn't think about it, like uh, um, at a loss for words, at how bad these things really are, right? Like, do you even think about the fact that there's, when you're placing these things around a perceived target, do you think about children, infants who were just born, who are now being affected by these devices? So it could just be a whole bunch of shit, like, but it's all centering around these electronic harassment devices. All right, I do, tell me about this, how could you, and interrogated, somebody got interrogated and ratted some people out. So, so this is also, look, attacking children. I'm telling you, that's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like they never really thought about. There could even be some people who were coming to attack somebody with these things. And now they're sorry because what? Because they could have been, they did this too quick. Oh, I'm sorry. I did this too quickly. How could you? Uh, I love you. <laughs> hmm. Somebody's child may be saying this. Like, how could you? You're an adult, right? But I, you know, this, this is just childish behavior. This is wanting to sabotage somebody for no reason. That's a good person, a loving person. Like these are people who didn't have a lot of love in their life. And when you do stuff like this, there's something wrong with how you feel about yourself in the world. Are you treating people the way you want to be treated? So don't tell me that these people are at a loss for words that they're going away from murder or attempted murder for using these electronic harassment devices. Like what? Like, maybe it's how could you, like, maybe these are the detectives going, how the fuck could you even think about when you get up in the morning, bringing these things to hurt somebody, to hurt children, to hurt somebody who could be pregnant, or just people that are around this part, even yourselves. Like, the, the, nai the naive mindset of people to sit there and turn these things on and sit there with them and not think for one second that they're affecting you more. You're right next to it. It's crazy to me that these people, like, I just feel like they're so hurt and just mean that it's like, I don't think about what it's doing to me. I never actually thought about whether this was going to come out one day and I was going to catch a murder rap or an attempted murder rap for this shit. And now, now I'm sorry. I feel like it's almost like, how could you possibly say you're sorry now? What? Because you're going away? <clears throat> Damn. Landlord secretly tries to copy your swag so for some of you your own it's your this person either is a landlord or this is your landlord let me get you some i feel like it's just general like there are even people who own buildings apartment buildings or who are property managers and everything that use these things and allow these things to be used because for those of us who really know what's going on with these we know that the government pays even hotels and motels to do this shit so there are people who I'm, I'm sure are getting exposed for this, like landlords, property managers, maintenance men, employees. For some of you, your own family members were using these things. It's just, just it's a very coward-like way to attack somebody. Nobody, nobody does anything with nobility anymore. Nobody goes and says, look, I got no problem with you. you. I don't even know you, but put your hands up in the air. For a lot of us, we would say, right on, let's fucking get down, you know? But it, and people don't do that anymore. It's just very malicious and vicious and covert and, yeah, like a traitor. Like, you can't even kill somebody in a noble way anymore d or s this could be dan dave steven scott sam what is this give me two more aaron definitely could be either these people are are the landlords and finding out this was going on or these are the names of the landlord what is this Tell me more. Give me one more, please. E or L. This could be Leo, Len, Ellen, Elaine. What's D A E? Because I'm sorry. Is that their answer? 
Is that why you guys put the word because? Are they being interrogated? Uh, is this what it is? Interrogate saying like, how could you even think of doing this? And is their answer just because uh, you fucking people are lost? You're lost. These are the people who belong in prison for this shit. 1010. 10. The ones who just are like, I don't know. Like you still want to be fucking cocky kind of shit, right? So good. We'll throw your cocky fucking uh, piece of shit ignorant evil unhealed asses in prison we got no problem you know a lot of these people when they get interrogated they think they're they think they're big and bad they don't give their names they don't say anything you can't imagine how much that's going to hurt you okay but if you're around me i'll get the name for you yeah it's simple like like it's simple for these people to do this shit or maybe they're saying it's really that simple like it's simple okay so that's your answer because cool turn around you're under arrest that's what it feels like it feels real fucking like quick cut dry that you don't need to overthink it um did you know that this was the charge for this nope okay uh we're doing this because it almost feels like the agents or detectives are just as cocky like okay we'll turn around what you doing what you doing this because motherfuckers all right because because the sense of entitlement that comes with this electronic harassment and this gang stalking from these people who think that they're tough and they're supposed to be feared because there's a whole bunch of them coming after one person do you know how embarrassing that is for people who are actually like real heroes, like people who actually like don't mind jumping in front of a bullet and then you got a whole bunch of people that band together. Yeah, let's go attack one person together. Yay. Or two people. Like it's really that simple. Let me see what DAE is here. DAE. Does anybody else... Okay. Something or someone that is funny and stupid, usually in a playful. Matt, Brazilian. Somebody could be Brazilian. Hold on. Savage killer, money making nigga like El Chapo. Okay, so maybe that's the kind of people these are. Are just, they're murderers anyway, you know? Some of them didn't realize just how detrimental these things were. They were just being good little servants and good little slaves to gang members and stuff, you know? These, uh, it's, it's so ass backwards. You'll have people who just want to belong to something so bad, right? And they think that it's tough to be part of these groups. But what they don't realize is when somebody tells you how to move, where to go, what to do, you're a fucking slave to that person. You know what I mean? They own you. Yeah, sorry. We're not down with that. We'd rather actually be free, okay? So, I mean, I guess that's just the message is that, you know, you start messing with these things and you, I don't know if some people are going to be getting out, you know, it could be one of them things where they did, had no idea that the charge was going to be like this. I'm the truth. There are a lot of these people going to be in there for good. Yeah. And then this is going to be a whole other level of exposure now because you're going to have people who didn't realize that they're going to be going away for this just by bringing one, right? Just by, just by having one in their possession. It's a weapon. It's a, what is, a, what do they call that? What, what type of weapons is that? With the devices, like electro, what's it called? Weaponized. I forget what they called it, but electronic, yeah, whatever, like warfare. Uh, this is when more people are going to be saying, well, I mean, how can I get out of this, you know? And then that's going to be another layer of crumble um, for these groups and, and, and people that just are sickening our society with this shit okay you got nothing better to do you couldn't go to the movies right you can't go outside and just enjoy your life like you have to get up during the day and and if, if you are the type of person where you have to wait for someone to text you or tell you where to go and what to do you are a slave to somebody we don't do that over here so i'm rat that's what i'm saying yo i'm telling this is now they're going to start ratting so this is the type of thing where you want to be cocked. No, I don't know nothing. No, bitches get stitches. Okay, well, wait to see what happens to your ass with some stitches when you get in a joint that you guys can't handle. Because most of these people are scared to death. They'll never, they don't show that, right? But we can see it. Now these people are all going to rat. Let me see if they want me if in particular to put the name of somebody in particular. Because sometimes they like me to do that. Stay tuned. Terrence Freeman, okay, is a rat. But he's a rat that's playing or going to play both sides. Tell me about this person. 
Terrence. Yeah, I'm telling you. Uh, this person is going to betray the people that he's closest to. I feel like this person has no choice. I feel like also this person may have said, yeah, I'll work with you, you know, I'll work with you and stuff like that. I just don't feel like he can be trusted. Tell me the truth. Can this person be trusted with the information? No. I, I would just, if he's going to go away, I would just say you're going away. They, he can't be trusted or they want to brought this up. All right, let me find out if there's anybody else that said that they would rat on their people, but they're really planning something else. Is there anybody else? No. It's just Terrence. Oh, well, buddy. I guess we'll see you next lifetime. We're not going nowhere. Love you, Philly out.